The Honorable Parliamentary Secretary. Russia. Thank you very much, Mr. Speaker. Our government's fall economic statement announces new measures in order to get more homes built faster. The leader of the Conservative Party has called that, and I quote, a disgusting scheme. Shameful. Mr. Speaker. Terrible. Why does the leader of the Conservative Party think that investments in the construction of 30,000 new rental apartments is disgusting? Why does the leader of the Conservative Party think that new federal investments for the construction of 7,000 new affordable homes is disgusting. Mr. Speaker, the leader of the Conservative Party owes us and Canadians an explanation. You're here. You're here. The Honourable uh, Leader of the Opposition. Mr. Speaker, those houses cannot be characterized with any ex adjective other than non-existent. They don't exist. They stand up day after day and list off the thousands of houses that they have not built. Yeah. They've had eight years. It would be one thing if they were still promising to build homes in their first year, maybe their second year. Okay, we'll give them three years. It has been eight years, and the only thing they have accomplished on housing since promising to make it affordable is doubling the cost. They have doubled the rent doubled mortgage payments, doubled the needed down payment for a home, and now we have $900 billion of mortgages that are coming up for renewal. That's two-thirds of all mortgages. And the, the IMF says we are the number one at risk of having a mortgage crisis. It is disgusting to think of the families who did everything right, who risk losing everything because of the irresponsible policies of this Prime Minister and his NDP government. Yeah.